everybody, Sinesk111 here, and welcome back to more One Step From Eden. I know I said that I was going to be taking a break for a few minutes while I get things situated, but I'm just way too into this game to take a break right now. I'm going to play as Hazel for this run. Hexawan Engineer builds dangerous things. Her starting spells are the minigun, gun turret, push up, and knock down, which I'm assuming is for the gun turret. Her starting artifact is the hex badge, and her weapon is the mech wrench, which is used for upgrading turrets that she places down. Alright, with all that reviewed, let's go. Hopefully I'll make it much farther than than I did in both my Celesty runs that I had this night. Well, that's good. Flawless already. Okay, so the first boss is Terra, so Moonstone's going to be quite useful. I don't know if the broken tiles in question are going to be on my side, or the enemy's side, or both. enemy has to come down one day. And by down, I mean to the ground. And alas, I keep forgetting to set my focuses yet again. Okay, Hexawan is pre-selected for us. So why not do a double focus? That sounds fine to me. Oh! Oh, it can go through things. The spirit coming out of that thing is... The way that happens is kind of creepy, but... Best not to think about it for now. Just gotta focus on getting as far as I possibly can. I was waiting for that gun turret. Gosh. Good gracious. There goes that hostage, but I don't think I'll really care about it. Hostages aren't going to be... aren't really going to be very important in most battles. But sometimes, in a life or death situation in this game, it may be necessary. Neither are chests like the one I just missed. If 
battle one again. Hired gun. That's not even in any of my focuses. I'm hoping to get a laser turret sometime in the future. Oh, that tile's broken. Oh. Oh, no, no, no. Okay, there we go. Opportunity here. That turret is doing. How? How did that turret defeat you? By shooting you, of course. But at least you've forgiven me. Which I'm okay with. That was stupid. I don't even know if that was a flawless. Yeah, it was a flawless victory. Dodging my shots. Don't like that. Okay, that finished him off, at least. Sword row. I kind of want more max mana now. I knew it had to go down at some point. Anubis is what I'll get for now. Here comes the mini boss. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Nope, bad time to use that. Why not? Better to be fully healed than not. Okay. 
both of these sound good. I don't have enough for the kinetic shield. I'll... I'll just upgrade a spell. In this case, my gun turret. Double summoned HP. It's what I use the most, and... The... The structures that I generated in that mini-boss fight just were destroyed way too quickly. will destroy her eventually. I wonder how much maximum spell power any anything can have. I've heard a saying in Unus Honus many times that this is what it means to go even further beyond. Oh. Yeah, bring the hostage over to me, and that effectively saves her. Odd, but I'll take it. That did a whopper. Yeah, I'll do salvage. She's a Hexawan engineer after all. She knows about all this kind of stuff. I should probably destroy that. Ooh! Get out of there. And down it goes. I should have taken it out first, but... Um... Circumstances can change. Any bosses have been taken care of very quickly. I haven't exactly known what luck does in this game. But I'm assuming that it has something to do with how good quality spells you'll be getting. Something like that? I don't know. I still don't have a lot of experience with this game for me to feel comfortable with knowing everything. Bam. Magic Claw, Glassify, Misty Shield. Magic Claw. Uh, I feel like I'm gonna sneeze again. 
I'll take the credit card again. Could be helpful. Oop. Uh oh. Uh oh. This is hellfire. Oh gosh. Fighting Saffron is proving quite a challenge. Even more so given that I don't have a lot of experience in it. Uh. Completely dodged it. And she's reviving. Oh. Okay. She's down. Rematch later. I'm gonna have to rematch you a couple of times in order to get used to fighting against you, Saffron. Hostage is saved now. Meditate. Yeah, I'll do it. Okay, that's done. Wow. I, I've been feeling the need to fight so many mini bosses this game. I wonder why that's the case. Accidentally hit the hostage there. Alright, there you go. You're saved. If I said shaved, I didn't mean to. There's so much spit in my mouth from when I speak. I don't know why, but I keep wanting to... This is going to sound a little bit bizarre to you, but lots of spit accumulate in my mouth. Lots of spit accumulates in my mouth whenever I read something out loud. Which I really do not like. And I wish I was more comfortable reading. Ah, uh, that wasn't a good place. I need a sneeze. I got the <laughs> Uh My goodness. I'm sorry. This is proving quite a puzzle. Ah, uh, but I solved it at least. Not without sneezing though. I think the luck from the lock boxes is what's been causing me to heal so much HP from when I've been getting bandages. I 
Give me some more stuff. Shard toss. I'll spend the rest of most of my money on upgrades. I'll upgrade the bow snipe to bow snipe I F J. Only cost one mana, but 50% damage, 25% chance to leave a flame on hit. I'll take the twice one. It could prove to be the most useful. And I'll upgrade the Sweeper as well. That's also useful. Oh, that's gonna be beautiful. Double cast Sweep. Didn't get to see it this battle. Definitely when I get to the boss. Okay. Since this is tier 3 Celacy, I'll need to be careful of her icicle attacks coming at me and back. Didn't think I was gonna dodge that one. Okay. Ah, no! I... Ah, got my own turret. I got Celacy with that bow, even though she wasn't in that specific row. Okay. Now she's gonna have to deal with the problem of flame thinning her battlefield. Or her side of it, at least. Isn't that on me today? This time, at least. There's also been some news about a game that I have played on this channel that I want to get back into soon because of a new update that's coming out starting this month. Well, a couple of updates coming starting this month. I'm not gonna talk about them right now to avoid spoilers. I want to keep it a surprise. too much on upgrading these turrets. Gotta avoid Celeste's attacks as well. And down she goes. I can be on my merry way. See Gunner. Go. Seeing this doesn't get... Ah, none of these look good.
Okay, another battle down, and it's flawless too. I didn't know when I would be seeing that again. Cover the whole enemy field in mine sometime. Don't care too much about losing the hostage. Just gotta avoid most of their attacks. Cannon, four spell power, and one fragile at the start of the battle. That sounds a bit tempting. I need more max mana. That's what I'll need. Build me up to full? No problem. Now let's see what's here at the store. Ooh, more max mana. I'll take it with open arms. Gain one trinity. If trinity is full, gain three spell power. Oh, more Max Mana, gimme, gimme. Um... I'll spend... Spend the... Upgrade Magic Claw. Bonus 40 damage, minus 10 on hit. Doesn't make a whole lot of sense. Okay, if I was going to choose between A and N, I'd choose N because of its high damage potential. It's only a tier 3 still. Oh! Okay, I have shield. Still not at full trinity yet. Boom, boom. Okay, successfully dodged out the way of that one. Now I'm giving you a taste of your own medicine. Uh, that wasn't good. Now the beacon's just going to pose a danger, or turret I meant, if it was still there. Uh, bad time to use that. The bow and the... Missile spell, I mean. Ah, didn't mean to go into the top row at this time. Stupid cracked tile.
Okay, that didn't accomplish much. Neither did that. Okay. That accomplished much against me. Yeah, channeling Saffron. Doing that really. Get that bomb out of the way at the cost of a tile that I will regain in a few seconds, like that, yeah. Okay, it's safe to attack him again. That didn't do squat. Uh. Okay, those crystals protected me. Thank you for that. I'm doing very good. Oopsie. Okay. Gunners down. There's only uh, Shiso and Revo to go, but I'm going to go after Revo first. Tier four bosses are the hardest tiers to are the hardest bosses to go up against. So here's a pro tip: be careful. Wow, took out both of these enemies with ease, with that sweep. I could see Bali being useful given that I have laid down so many structures. I live life dangerously. on you, Sparky Boy. Double cast is going to be a bit problematic for a self-defense turret. <sighs> Save the hostage, then kill them outright. Ironic. Wow, lots of helpers. That's probably the most I've had in battle. Let's see, I get through that. All this chaos. Yeah, gotta unleash hell on them. I think I should take a break on stocking up on weapons for right now. On, let's see what this shop has.
I can take half of mana regen. What's the worst that could happen? I uh, I say as I think about whether I have jinxed myself or not. much damage I've been doing. The engineers back at Hexawan are gonna be proud of me for making it this far. If I keep up, if I keep this up, I think I might make it to the gate. Uh, this is tier 4. I haven't fought, I haven't officially fought this tier of Reva before. I say as I remember that I did in a practice run that I had earlier today. I don't know if this is the case, but I believe that I think that 10 is the max is the absolute maximum amount of mana that you can have at any one time. And that turret is not doing much for me. Might as well just destroy it. I'm having trouble knowing what counts as misses and what counts as dodges. This is so tense. One thing that I think that maybe I should have done early on is have, sh have Reva join my team. And I... Well, my eyes didn't need to be closed for that one. Dang. That was such a good run. And yep, no more unlocks are remaining in store for me. And that is going to bring this part to a close. I haven't practiced with Hazel any, so I'm very surprised I made it this far. Okay, but I'll still need practice, so just hang in there. Well, until next time, thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you. Bye!